not gonna lie, not terribly excited about riding this. Yeah, once you see me, cat was out of the bag. I'll tell you what, my mum's gonna be well proud of. Me. Now we're talking. Okay. Currently sat outside a motorcycle training road rider centre. Um, for any of you that don't know, I do not have a motorbike license, which is pretty common, I think, in, in um, motorbike racing. But I've just had a bit of a brainwave and realised that we're building um, all these little 50cc gag bikes and stuff, which are all road legal, and I won't be able to ride any of them. So it sort of defeats the purpose of that. So I got booked in a few months ago because the waiting list is absolutely mental. Um, and I'm literally going to go and do my test today, CBT test. This is not a... I'm not even going to video the name of it, it's not a plug, I've paid, I've paid to come here, the guy doesn't know I race motorbikes, nothing, he asked me if I was fit to change gear and stuff, and I said yeah, I think so, depending on the bike, <laughs> so he's got no idea uh, what I do for a living, um, I probably won't try and not tell him actually until he asks or he notices, I brought a couple of helmets, I was trying to get an old helmet that wasn't painted, but he said that you'd probably be okay with an open face one, so I've brought my trials helmet. Because I think a lot of it's just round cones and stuff in the car park. Yeah, so that's what we're that's what I'm doing today. Uh hopefully I pass and then if I do pass I'll be able to get out on the road on my little um YSR with James and that because they've all got little fifties and stuff as well. So that's the plan. But um yeah, so I'm gonna try and get some footage of what happens in a bike test and if I can actually pass one. Right, so it turns out that there's, uh, well, it seems to be that there's like other people on this course as well. So I don't know if I'm going to be able to vlog it or what the situation is. I thought it would literally be, sorry, just me, but we'll see. See what he says. Yeah, once he see me, a cat was out of the bag. So that was that screw straight away. <laughs> Big surprise over. Probably should have videoed it to be fair, but I wanted to ask first before um, we do any vlogging and stuff because some people don't really always like it so I thought I'd be polite to at least ask. What are we doing now first? Just going to fill in a little bit of paperwork. Yeah. It's just for our insurance purposes because um, obviously we've all got to be insured, we've all got to be yeah. nice and safe uh, but I need your driving license for that. Oh. Uh, oh. Do I need to have a driving license? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it'd be nice if you did. Uh, so, yeah. uh, a little bit of a, it's just purely simple to say you're covered on our bikes that's all, nothing yeah. more, nothing less. Just while I get some bikes out there, and then we'll get your wonderful steed out for today. You are going to be so impressed with what the bike I'm going to put you on today. It is underwhelming. I'll find another one that's exactly the same. Uh, not going to lie, not terribly excited about riding this, but needs most and all that. <laughs> All it needs is a shopping basket on the front. Right, so sign on, part done, obviously filled out my license form. Um, I've done some checks over on the bikes and stuff, obviously how to put oil in, check brake pads, all them things that I don't know anything about. <laughs> but um, yeah, so all them bits are done. Um, next thing now we'll be probably doing some writing stuff and then uh, maybe we'll soon get a spin on this absolute weapon. I just realised she's got some trick little indicators and some blue uh, valve caps. Check these out. Oh. Whoa, listen to that. She just oozes horsepower. This is pretty much the space we have to deal with. So if we hit anything, it's not a good sign, is it? So I think we're gonna do some riding in here first to see if we can actually ride. And uh, once we can ride in here, then we go get to do some stuff on the road. So I'll probably set the camera on the ground or something. I haven't brought the GoPro or anything um, because the high speed nature of the, the event, but I'll uh, set the camera on the ground somewhere and see if we can yeah, get some of the manoeuvres on board. Yep. 
Just get my love. I will point out to you guys, I'm retired. I do this because I want to, not I know, I'm sorry. Okay, so you can put your gear, left foot yeah. down, fingers off the front brake, it's all about clutch accelerator and back brake. Just nice and steady, you can ride towards you, nice and gently. It's all about using accelerator, clutch and back brake. I can't see you having a problem with this. Okay. But we'll go through the motions, yeah. shall we? Nice control link. So if you're going too fast, I'm jumping kids to the back brake. Why do they use the back brake on the road? Set the brake down. All right. Nice balance. The same way you can try out the back brake more. If you don't need to bend a little bit too fast, yeah. the back brake will help control it. Because a lot of road riders can't... Um, Feel the front. So they, they can't, you know, control brake yeah. corners. They can't trail brake. Yeah. To be fair, I can't either. Four times round on your own, as close as the counter you can, nice and steady, nice and slow. The next day. I wonder if we get to have a little race today. Tom looks a bit lively. See if we can get a race them. Okay. Built into me or what? Well, I just keep wanting to go faster than what I'm than what I'm doing right now. So that's us done in the car park. Tom's just finishing off doing some of his emergency stops. I've just done mine. Um, didn't get any footage of that because I was too worried about running over the camera. <laughs> but yeah, so that's us done in the car park. I think now we're just going to pop back to where the bikes come from um, and then just do some road riding and stuff. And I think that should, that should hopefully be us, I think. I don't know. I've got a GoPro with me, but I don't know whether I can get it on the the bike running because I don't really want to start sticking mounts onto the bike and stuff but I'll um, if I can I will um, obviously I don't want to stick one on my helmet because we're not allowed allowed them on our helmet at, at BSB and stuff but yeah if I can get one on the bike I will or maybe a strap of some sort if not um, the next time I check in will hopefully be with my certificate unless I do something severely wrong bad news I didn't appreciate any of the wheelies I was doing on the road section, so we failed. Nah, only joking. Look at this. Tell you what, my mum's going to be well proud. I've never had any certificates, probably since the 20 metres breaststroke when I was at primary school. Oh, so, yeah. CBT. I think I'll probably have to wait a while now before I can go and get my... Well, I'll have to go do my theory test. Um, and then the guy's got another bloody waiting list to do the full test. So um, whenever I can do that, that's going to be the next thing on the agenda. Because I might as well have it. So, um, yeah, I'll go and do go and do my full test. Um, yeah, hope you enjoy watching this. Something a little bit different. Having a clue when this is going to come out or what the situation is, but I thought I might as well might as well video it. People like to see stuff, what I get up to. So, um, yeah, hope you enjoyed it. Please chuck a, a like and a, a comment in the comment section if um, you have or you thought it was rubbish. Either way, any good, any feedback, say good feedback. So, thanks, guys. Bye-bye.